What is up guys, Austin Urcho here, back again playing Ark Survival Evolved on the Ragnarok server. And let's see, I've got a surprise for you. And a three, and a two, and a one. <laughs> so we got the Dilophosaurus helmet from the Ark event. I guess I turn it back off again. But I'm just sitting here hanging out on my saber tooth, which I don't think has a name yet. Let's see. Oh, I just kind of ruined a surprise there for you. Oh well. Um, but yeah, I don't think the saber tooth has a name. You know, it's just saber tooth. Um, so I started to mention. I can't. I'm so confused. Says I started to record an Ark video for this past week but had some issues going on and everything so um i don't remember what i said in the like that i started to do for that episode and then confused and everything but um i mentioned i think it pretty sure it was in the last episode where i got the saber tooth um the last episode I actually did i got the saber tooth i mentioned that i was going to start taking names so if you want to name any of the dinos which everything's pretty much open i said except for uh uh, King Moonracer, the Griffin, everything, anything you want to name, you can set out, out of any of the dinos. Then, of course, once someone gives me a name, that's going to be the dino's name. So I'm not going to change it after that. But here we've got, our, of course, our saber tooth, as I mentioned. Then we got a Spino as well, 150. So it was 150. But this was what I was working on in the last episode that did not get recorded. Was getting these new tech dinos. So here, of course, we have the tech Stego, which is just a Stego see if we can get it turned around here with the tech outfit on so it's all teched out and everything and I wonder because there was something I was gonna do today but I don't see the thing anymore but yeah we got the tech stay going it just became a whole disaster of trying to get this thing and accidentally killing some better ones so this was a really low level I think like a 20 something so that kind of just stinks that it was that low of level but you know did what I could do with it but I want to look over here um, there was a decently leveled uh, uh, trying to think of what it was called uh, Carno over here stuck right at or not stuck but it was right at the wall here where like these rocks are and everything like trying to get in of course and I don't know if it's moved down at all or where it went but it was a level 100 i'm hoping that it gets stuck at the wall there and then we could tame it oh get stuck on everything but hopefully the game whoa that trended on just fell all the way down uh, but hopefully the game's running okay like of course i'm having some issues like myself with frame rates like in the game probably because of the location being next to water and then all the building stuff i'm doing um but i've been having issues with the recording so i tried um getting a new recording not really new but like updating it and getting it up to date and to work better and I tried to do you know 60 frames um, or FPS whatever you want to call it to try and you know have the best possible but it just like completely I want to say crashed or wrecked my computer but it, it didn't do that it just it did not work and like it at all I was trying to see if I could find there's a bunch of raptors right there raptors all sorts of new dinos have respawned in over here. It's kind of crazy. Usually, lately, there's been absolutely nothing. That car must have fell off the edge or something. I went ahead and took the doors down off this in the last episode. I just, I like it being open more. There's a, I think, a pretty blue train. Oh, 130. And it was like the bluish purple for that weird event that I thought was over by now. Or I thought was going to be over, but maybe not. But let's try to remember what I, Oh, yeah. So I want to try to tame some stuff, but I need the veggie cakes. Like I want to get those uh, sheep. Like I had that one trapped over in the scorched earth or in the desert area, which I'm sure it's probably gone by now. But I want to do that. So I've got to prepare for it because I need the tree tap. So I need to bring in some metal over here. we go and we'll go to metal ingots down in here of course we have the s plus so we're able to pull everything so metal um but yeah arcs just kind of get me down now, every time i try and get on here i'm always having issues i know it's probably just me not being good at this game because that's pretty usual for me not being good at a game i need okay so i did pull enough metal we'll go with s plus and we'll do i forget how many you can stick in a tree uh, depending on what tree you get I'll go ahead and 
Apparently I thought I did tap four, but apparently not. And then we need some mini paste, so I need a couple hundreds some mini paste. I thought I just clicked it. Cementine paste, what do we got? Crafting station, yes, we'll go ahead and take 500, I guess. And then we need, oh, we need more metal now too. I didn't see how much we need because and we also need to get the bee honey so that's what we're gonna work on today hopefully so let's go with 200 hopefully I don't want to overload because I hardly use this okay and then we need wood so we need wood now got to get the wood um where's oh yeah W It'd be nice if I could remember that's wool wood there we go B yeah from bebop the beaver let's just go with 500 don't know if that's how much I needed or not, but we're going with it. No, oh, we need a lot, so we need the gather. We'll take like 2,000, I guess. Go back down to wood, and I'm just gonna do one platform for now. I feel that should be enough. I don't know for sure. I've only done tree taps once. Y'all yeah, go ahead and take that. And I believe that's all I need from there. So now we got to fly over to the redwood, which we have all these trees, but they're not redwoods, even though they look like it. But we got to fly to the redwoods now. So I will fly over that way. I'm pretty sure, yeah, they're this way. I'll fly over this way, find the redwoods. We'll stick the tree up real quick. Then we'll fly back to the base, grab a, a bear. Hopefully there's some I can reach. I need to look for beehives. I, I may tame a bee. I'm not exactly sure. I really want that Quetzal too. I'm pretty sure it's the wrong button. Pretty sure on the Griffin I can do it. I would just have to chase it. Oh, that's a 15. Maybe not that one, but um, I just need to chase it around since I can pull out a gun. Like I can pull out the Trank Dart while flying stuff. So I'm pretty sure as long as, I mean, I'd have issues with stamina, everything, but I could just fly after the um, Quetzal and everything. Hopefully I don't die, but I'm going to fly to the Redwoods, put it up the tree, I'll bring it back for that, and then once we get back to the base, I'll decide whether I want to tame a bee, or uh, just go out on a bear and gather honey. I'll decide that, and we'll come back and do that together as well, so once we'll see when we get to the Redwoods. Okay, so I found a tree here right in front of us, that's pretty much the closest tree that there is, I forget where the thing is, oh there we go. So there we got the tree platform put on. Hopefully there's none of those stupid cat things that jump out on you. Um, so yeah, this is the closest uh, uh, tree that I could find. The fat redwood trees that's closest to like the fly area to my base. I don't know if I can pull it up on the map here. So yeah, it's just, you know, right on the edge of the snow, which I don't know if you can see, you could earlier, it's just right over there's the snow and then that whole deep trench thing for the volcano and all that sort of stuff. So let's go ahead and now put our tree, oops, tree taps in. So of course there's a spot, there's a spot. I don't know if there's a spot on every part of the tree or there's only so many you can do. I don't know for sure. And there we go. So yeah, we were able to do four and then so that will start producing some tree sap, hopefully. Obviously, obviously I think it takes a while so we won't be seeing it anytime soon, I wouldn't imagine. It'd be cool to see at least one grouping show up or something. But I think it takes a while, I believe. Yeah, I think so. I may try to knock some of these trees down around us. So maybe, hopefully... See if we can do it from up here. Yeah, I like that. So that way we can at least have a clear walkway around up here. And Okay, so that one we can't do. Oh, I'm trapped in the trees. Let's see if we can fly down here a little bit. Take out this tree. There we go. So hopefully those won't grow back. Hopefully so that way we have a clear view up here to our tree platform. So it's first one I've done of this season here. Let's see if anything's come up yet. Nope. 
which I doubt it. Okay. I thought, so just a funny little story thing, not funny, but again, my horrible memory issues that I have, and I mentioned a lot on the videos, is that, uh, so I was flying over here, got, you know, into the trees here, and started to look around for trees that you could put a platform on, and I was like, oh wait, I forgot to bring the platform and everything, and so I flew all the way back to my base, and when I got there and went to the um, smithy to pick it up, it wasn't in there. I'm like, wait, what? So I look in my inventory and it was in there the whole time. So I flew all the way back for no reason. So I'm going to fly back. And like I said, I'll probably have to craft up. I think I'm going to try and tame a bee. So I'm going to craft up uh, some ghillie suits. So I'll have to kill like these things, get some organic polymer and everything. So I'll kill these because I saw a bunch on my way here. So I'll gather up a bunch of organic polymer and craft up the ghillie suit and everything. And then we'll go out and try and tame a bee. Hopefully this works out if it works like I did or like it did the last time. So I think that's like a wyvern area. But I haven't seen any wyverns. I'm not going to look right now. I don't really have issues in the, or interest in the wyverns. Especially since you have to use the wyvern milk to do the babies and stuff i don't have any interest in that sort of stuff at all i don't want to knock out a dragon just to get milk from it doesn't seem interesting at all to me so not going for wyverns but i'm gonna gather up some organic polymer here and then we'll be back at base once we're ready to go off and get a bee so i'll see you then Okay, so I made it back to base, and just for a little fun thing, um, when I was flying back, that Quetzal I showed earlier was flying right above that area, you know, that I have uh, fenced off right up there that you can see. Um, it was flying, like, super low up there, so I'm like, hey, maybe I can just try and uh, hit a few shots on it and get it to go down and everything. So I, because, um, you know, it was a low level when I showed it to, it to you guys. Um, so I thought, oh, maybe I can get it to go down and everything, and it'll be... Uh, fun and everything and so I tried shooting it and it uh, I was able to keep up with it on moon racer and shoot it and everything But it just kept flying and it went up into the cold area over there That's like as soon as you enter it's just freezing and I don't have my fur gear on me or anything So I lost it, but I got stuck up against the wall. So I'm like, oh, this is gonna be perfect I'm gonna get it tamed, but I never did so that just kind of stinks So we need to go in here and make sure we have gilly Um, I thought it was Gilly le Leggings, so we do have that. What's it say? Kim, uh, where do you craft these? Do you just do them in your regular inventory? Let's see. Uh, wrong one. Crafty. Let's go with armor. Oh, yeah, you do. Right in your inventory. So I need the hide and organic stuff. I thought you'd do in here, so that's why I came over. So, of course, I got a whole bunch of stuff. Take a bunch of this hide. And then a bunch of the organic polymer out here. I could probably, I think I have some like stuff for better ghillie, but I'm just going to go with the normal. So I'll go with two of everything. Till we run out obviously here. And there we go. So we should have all of that. I don't remember all you need. I forgot you need a uh, bug repellent. Forgot about that. Uh, Mortar and pestle. We can learn that. So rock carrot, narcotic, pet hair, and citronol. So I can easily, not easily, but I can craft that up pretty easily. So let's go here with the uh, bug repel. So we need narcotic, which I have. Just go ahead and stick that in there. Narcotic. And then we need pelt wool, which I think I have in one of these. I think I've put some in here. Oh yeah, just grab two stacks like that. Again, I don't remember which one I stuck this stuff in. So pelt. And then, if I click the right thing, then we need rock, carrot, and citronol. Four of each, So, but we'll make a couple, obviously. So I should have all of them, the ghillie suit. Yes, I have all the ghillie suit now. Let's go ahead and put all of this on. And hopefully we won't uh, die from using like the weaker stuff. Let's go ahead and put um, the organic polymer back. And then we'll pull it off and stick it onto our uh, 
this thing here. We'll do that. Um, so I need to grab the citronol. So let's run back up here. Uh, yeah, I'll just leave that there because I will be grabbing. Um, yeah, I usually do it with the Tranodon. I did a video on this last season, I think, on the island server. And um, oh, I forgot. I did a whistle, so everything was like running over this way. So I need to rock carry it. We'll grab this smaller stacks and that. Let's run back. Craft this up real quick. So it looks like so far after doing like, you know, the couple um, shots so far, it looks like the frames are doing pretty good on the recording. So hopefully it's all good now. So now let's craft. Yeah, we'll just go and craft all that there is. Take what's left when we're done. Go ahead and run over and grab the Tranodon. And then I think you need flowers for the bee, the queen bee to get to tame one. Um, I need to look it up real quick before I go and do it for sure. But let's go ahead and grab the train it on. I forget which one's the better. Obviously probably the higher level one because we got to do our spins on it. So let's fly down over here. And probably should add, more than anything, some stamina. Because stamina is always the worst part of the game. Let's see, is it crafted up now? Whoops, as I walk past it. Oh no, we do have six. Um, so I'm just going to sit around for that. And then once it's done, we will fly over. I'll look up to see what I need for the bee for sure. I'm pretty sure it's the rare flower, which I have in my refrigerators as well. But I will grab some of those and we'll fly over. I know where there's some uh, bees um, over this way towards our uh, taming pen. So towards, I think they call it Viking Bay or something. So we'll try over there first. And yeah, so that's about done. So I will see you when we get over to the beehives and tame a bee. Okay, so we've got a beehive right here. As you can see right there, we've got ourselves a beehive. Hopefully I can hit this. I didn't think about like testing it out first. Uh, but obviously all you have to do is get on a Tranodon. Land up here just to check to make sure there's nothing dangerous around because obviously we'll have to be on the ground and making contact with the bees and everything. So hopefully, and I got to remember to hit the right buttons. So I do have the rare flowers, the bug spray. So once the thing happens and you just do that. And then since you're flying so fast and everything, the bees, like the workers and stuff, whatever that fly out, can't keep up with you. And so you just keep flying around and waiting for it to break. And then the queen will fall out, obviously. And it should be pretty... damaged here if it's not already I can't so yeah it's gone already so let's hope we see a queen bee on the ground maybe I can't see um I don't see a queen bee anywhere. Hopefully we didn't kill it. But I don't see one fluttering around anywhere. Um, let's walk down here. See if maybe it's just... Oh, nope. There it is right there. So let's take the on, Stick it right here. Hopefully this will be a good spot. Nothing will get it. Let's go ahead and hit... Our bug repellent, so we should have bug repellent on now. Let's go ahead and crouch down, and we've got to hit the E button when we get close enough to it, which you got to do pretty fast because the drones and stuff will come and start attacking you. I wish I knew where she was. Okay, there she is. All this stupid plants and everything I can't see. 
Because you got to do it real quick. There they are. Shoot. There we go. So we've got our bee now. So now all the little bees are good now. So let's pick up the queen. Um, where's the queen? I can't freaking see. Are you the queen? There should be, oh there we go, obtain beehive. So there we go. So now all the bees are gone. And so we got our beehive. It'd be nice to do this to get multiple, which I did see, I'll have to check the area. I did see there was another beehive right there. Um, I'm gonna see if there's any others in the area. And then how dangerous is the ground? Ooh, there's some lower beehives. I don't really see anything dangerous in this area. So let's maybe try and get another one as well. Oh shoot, I forgot where it was. I was trying to figure out which button to hit. Okay, so let's try this again. There we go, we hit it once. The higher one up, up one may have been better. Go second time. Okay, now the frames are going down really low. So sorry about all of that. There we go. Did we do it that time? Let's get out of the trees. Okay, I don't see it. So that means the queen has to be somewhere. So the beehive looks like it's gone so the queen should be around here if there is a queen because sometimes there's not queens in hives but I feel there I've never not found one myself but let's hop off because she could be up high could be down low you never know where she could be I may have lost the queen or like I said she may not have this one may not have produced a queen okay well I'm gonna I guess uh, see if I can get another one I may try some of these other beehives if I don't find this queen I don't see one anywhere but I'll try and get another one and I'll get it take it back to base as well and then we'll set up a beehive there so I will see you then okay and so I made it back to the base and I did get a second one and uh, kind of was a little bit of a, I guess turned into a disaster I mean I was able to fix it in the end so I guess it doesn't really matter but I was able to get the second beehive so we now have two beehives and um, so I got the since that uh, second beehive I tried to get did not get anything I did a s another one and so uh, as I did it it released two so we got two beehives from the second one go and stick these back here there we go right next to each other um, so we got the second beehive uh, so, sorry, I'm trying to stick, figure out what I'm trying to say in my story here. Um, so we'll go ahead and just stick the bug repel in there. I got cactus stuff from some, I don't know. And I did get a red drop, so I got some ascendant flak legs and a deodon saddle, whatever that is. Blueprints and a C4 charge. Um, I keep forgetting that's not automatic door. Uh, but I 
uh, so when I tried to do the second one, I got the one of the bees, and so there's still a second bee floating around because I don't know if I said it, it produced two bees, the second bee high vi attack. And so I tried to get that second one, and I don't know if it's because I already tamed one out of the thing, it wouldn't like uh, clear it out or something. So the second bee hive, uh, or that second bee from the hive, I couldn't get for some reason, like it just would not let me do it. So um, it was weird, but I had the first one, but it ended up. Uh, dying due to the other bee because I kept trying to tame it and so it kept producing the other bees and stuff and so they ended up killing me and the bee I did tame and so I went flew back on a moon racer flew back over there got my stuff so I have all my inventory back and everything and that other bee was still there so I put all the stuff back on put on the bug repellent and everything and got the uh, second one and so that's how I got the two beehives so now I don't think we can do anything else for now. Um, once again, I'm forgetting. Because I think we need sap. And I wish the thing over here would tell us. But because it's like a secret recipe and I haven't found the thing for it yet. Yeah, there's no things to like tell. Um, so I wish I knew what the ingredients Like I said, I looked it up. So I knew you needed uh, beehive stuff and tree sap. And so obviously we put the tree sap up and we've got the beehive here, which looks like it's not produced anything yet out of there. So we can't obviously do anything any further, but I'm trying to think if there was something I wanted to tame. I can't remember. I may fly over here, see if I can find that Quetzal because I was thinking about that Quetzal would be really helpful. I'm wondering if it's out of the snow area yet. So let's fly up here and take a look. Because that was right up in here. Ooh, there's a pretty blue Diplodocus. I'm seeing all the blue dinos. Of course, every single one I find is like super low level. So it's not worth taming or anything. Ooh, there's one of those things. Oh, there's like a bluish purple bear across the way. Um, I don't see the Quetzal over here anymore, at least currently. But it was flying in that direction, like towards that wall over there, across the pond. Oh, there it is right there still. Yep, stuck on there, but of course it's freezing over here and everything I do, um, I can't not freeze for some reason. But I think that may be it for the day, just be a shorter episode. Cause like I said, I don't know of anything else I want to tame right now. Like I said, I would like to tame, you know, one of these cool looking dinos, but none of them are really worth any levels or anything like all the blue tranodons and stuff. So I think that I'm just going to call it a day for the episode where we're trying to prepare to make veggie cakes. Kind of a boring thing, you know, just to make veggie cakes. It takes all this effort, but we got to let stuff craft up of the beehive and the tree sap. And then we can obviously tame up one of the, or not one but a couple of the sheep is what i want to get and hopefully that one high level one i found is still over in scorched earth or the desert just waiting for me i hope it looks up at the sky at night looking at the same stars i do and wish we were there together as we're separated apart um but yeah we got that so we need the tree sap and all that and like i said i can't think of anything else i thought there was something else i wanted to do but I cannot think of it right now. So I think that's going to be it for today. Like I said, probably a shorter episode. Could be long. I don't know for sure. Not keeping track of the time. Oh, yeah, I need to put the flowers back. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed what you, um, this episode of what we did do. And um, I thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave any comments you have down below. And don't forget to give a thumbs up if you did enjoy this episode. And please subscribe to see more ARC videos. And we will see you next time. Right, Moon Racer? Yeah, sure. You're correct. Well, see you later. Just